welcome to our new video that is mcqs on microscope stain and staining techniques and this is the fourth part of this series of videos on microscope stain and staining techniques so the first question is which biochemical test is done specifically for identification of staphylococcus species and the options are coagulus test methyl red test triple sugar iron test or none of the above and the right answer is the option a that is coagulus test so coagulus test is performed to specifically identify staphylococcus species okay so next question they can give me which biochemical test is done to identify specific gram positive cocci and the options are pyro pyrolidinyl acryl amidase test or coagulus test or ureus test or all of the above and the right answer is option a that is pyrolidinyl acryl amidase test okay so which is performed to identify specific gram positive cocci so next question they can get that is electron sorry electron microscopy provides information about surface topography composition size and conductivity or all of the above and the right answer is the option d that is all of the above so electron microscopy provides information about all of the above that is surface topography composition and size and conductivity so move on to the next question that is the types of signal produced by scanning electron microscope are secondary electrons back scattered electrons spe uh, specimen correct current and transmitted electrons or all of the above and the right answer is option d that is all of the above are types of signal produced by scanning electron microscope to scan the object or microorganisms so that are secondary electrons backscatter electrons and specimen current and transmitted electrons so next question kya hai next question is what is the type of the electron beam that are reflected from the sample by elastic scattering in scanning electron microscopy and the options are transmitted electrons secondary electrons backscattered electrons and none of the above and the right answer is option c that is backscattered electrons so backscattered electron is a type of electron beam that are reflected from the sample by elastic scattering in scanning electron microscope so next question kya hai next question is mycobacterium tuberculosis and mycobacterium lepri are stained using negative staining capsule staining flagella staining or acid first staining and the right answer is option d that is acid first staining so mycobacterium tuberculosis and mycobacterium lepri are acid are stained with acid first staining methods so they are acid first bacteria okay so move on to the next question kya hai so staphylococcus aureus stained with gram stain procedure appears under microscope that is colorless or purple or pink or blue and the right answer is option b that is purple so they are gram positive bacteria that is staphylococcus aureus are gram positive because they give purple color during gram stain okay so move on to the next that is which of the stain is used to stain endospore and the options are malachite green methylene blue saffronin or crystal violet and the right answer is option a that is malachite green so malachite green is the stain which is used to stain endospore so it is used as a endospore staining okay so next question they can get the mechanism of bending of light by glass prism is because because glass has different refractive index from air and strike its surface at an angle the next option is simply it slows the velocity of light third option it's the potential feature of glass to bend light and the last option is the above question is wrong so the right answer is option a that is because glass has different refractive index 
from air and strike its surface at an angle that's why the mechanism that is the mechanism of bending light by glass prism okay so move on to the next question in microscopy the convex lens focuses rays at specific point called as focal point focal length point of interface or light striking point and the right answer is option a it is focal point so in microscopy the convex lens focuses rays at specific point which is known as focal point so next question kya hai next hai the point between the center of the lens and the focal point is called as focal point or focal length or point of interface or light striking point and the right answer is option B that is focal length so the point between the center of the lens and focal point is called focal length so next question kya hai next hai find thread like organelles of bacteria that are used for locomotion are called mitochondria capsule endospore or flagella this is very easy that is option D that is flagella so find red like organelles of bacteria that are used for locomotion is flagella so next question is the thickness of the flagella is increased by coating them with basic dye acidic dye specific mordant or gram stain and the right answer is option C that is specific mordant so the thickness of the flagella is increased by coating them with specific mordant so the next question is in gram staining alcohol is used as decolorizer mordant primary stain or counter stain and the right answer is option a that is decolorizer so in gram staining alcohol is used as a decolorizer so the next question so next question is microscope that measure the surface features by moving a sharp probe over the object surface is light microscope transmission electron microscope scanning electron microscope or scanning probe microscope and the right answer is option d that is scanning probe microscope so microscope that measure the surface feature by moving a sharp probe over the object surface is called scanning probe microscope okay so next question kya hai next hai. scanning tunneling microscope was invented in 1950s 1980s this is s 1970s or 1960s and the right answer is option b that is 1980s so scanning tunnel uh, scanning tunneling microscope was invented in 1980s so next question they can give me so next question is scanning tunneling microscope can achieve magnification of 1 million 10 million 100 million or 1000 million and the right answer is option C that is 100 million so scanning tunneling microscope can achieve magnification of 100 million okay so this is the magnification so next question is Escherichia coli appears reddish brown pink under microscope because it is a gram positive bacteria gram negative bacteria acid first bacteria or none of the above and the right answer is option B it is, it is a gram negative bacteria that's why it appears as, as reddish brown pink okay so the next question is gray method used for flagella staining uses as stain that is basic fusion or para rosanil or crystal violet or safranin and the right answer is option a that is basic fusion is used as a flagella staining as a stain in flagella staining in gray method okay so the last question of this video is the detailed internal structure of larger microorganisms can be best observed using transmission electron microscope scanning electron microscope both of the, them or none of them and the right answer is option c that is both of them can be used for detailed internal structure of larger microorganisms okay so these are all 20 questions of this video on microscope stain and staining techniques okay so thank you for watching this video